most important thing is we make it home uh, to our families. Arborists gathered in Scissortail Park today to learn how to climb up and give first aid to an injured coworker. And what we're doing is um, aerial rescue training for uh, responding to a climber that is uh, in a state of whatever in a tree and can't get back down. They say with so many deaths in the industry, they want to make sure people are ready. So they put them up climbing in trees like this with dummies like this to learn how to help. This is the, one of the most dangerous jobs in the world. When I was a young company, I was doing all the work. Uh, and then as soon as I started having guys work for me uh, and be in this dangerous situation, uh, I wanted to make it as safe as possible. But they also teach caution and to wait for help. Just do not become a second victim. If it's a uh, situation that you don't feel comfortable getting into and responding to and knowing that you have a good possibility of bringing the victim down, don't head up there. R&B Tree Service says getting as many people involved as possible is important. So typically uh, in a situation, you're only going to have one, maybe two people on the job site that can actually climb. Uh, so what we want to try and do is develop a network of people that you could call and help. Uh, they say sometimes first responders can only help so much with the equipment they have. So they need people in the industry to care more about safety. What, what we are trying to do here mainly is stoke the fire um, because this is great and these little events are great for training, but really what we, we want to help people do is go within their own companies and their own operations and establish emergency action procedures. Colby Terrell, KOCO 5 News.